Your Majesties, Your Royal Highnesses, Excellencies, ladies and gentlemen, I am so deeply honored to receive the Polar Music Prize. Thank you, members of the Polar Music Prize Award Committee. It is indeed a humbling experience to be joining the ranks of so many of my personal heroes. It is also a particular source of pleasure to receive this award alongside Paul Simon. I often think that the sounds I make when I play the cello are but the tip of the iceberg. Beneath what is audible are the ideas of working towards something bigger than oneself, advocating for unheard voices, and taking pleasure in the success of others. As I reflect on the intentions of the Polar Music Prize, I realize that the tip of this polar iceberg and much of Swedish society also rests on such fundamental values. Your philosophy has influenced my thinking from an early age. From reading Doc Hammarskjöld in high school, Cicela Bach's moral ethical philosophy in college, to first discovering the Scandinavian values of social responsibility in Minneapolis, a distant suburb of Stockholm. <laughs> More recently, in reading about the concept of logum, I recognize the work-life balance my family has been trying to teach me all these years. So many people have helped me to be present tonight, but more, none more than my family, my dear wife Jill, and our children, Nicholas and Emily. As time goes by, I realize that it is precisely this delicate balance between the love of family and the values that I try to practice every day that give true meaning to life. Thank you all once again.